Hi, I'm Doug with Skylift Hardware. I want to make sure when we show you these videos and helpful tips, you always consult with your local building jurisdiction regarding your codes in your areas that apply to your region or your specific location. This is just a general overview. This is not to say specifically how you might build your project, but always consult with local officials, engineers, and your site planning, architects, design professionals. Do your due diligence. We're just gonna show you a few helpful tips that might help you in your plan. Thank you so much. What we'd like to address right now is a question that's asked. People have asked this question, won't, won't the sky lift fly off the roof? Is it gonna fly off the roof like a wing? Well, it's not. And there's a couple reasons why that is. The sky lift shape, a flyover patio cover is not a wing, delt, not a wing shape, it's, it's flat. Like a race car that has a spoiler on the back. So as the wind is rushing, coming at the, the, the spoiler or the cover, it's actually pushing down. That's why they put them on race cars because the wind pushes the tail of that car down. Same effect with the Skylift. The wind's pushing down, wind coming into the cover here is venting out, you have more pressure here, less pressure here. It's not going to fly off, never has. Couple other reasons for that. The sky lift is attached to the top of the exterior wall. Very structural element. The outbound posts are anchored out here. This thing is not flying off, never has, and never will.